I'm studying brain damage that can occur before or around the time of birth in babies that might be deprived of oxygen. So this can happen from things like a knot in the umbilical cord or an umbilical cord around the neck, which cuts off the baby's blood supply and oxygen supply and can cause brain injury. Currently, we've got one available treatment for these babies, which is cooling. So they place a, a cooling cap on the head of the baby and pipe cold water over the baby's head for around three days. And this has been shown to actually significantly improve um, outcome for these babies. They'll have less brain damage, less disability. But not for all babies. Many babies, even if they're treated with this cooling, will still have severe brain damage. So we're looking to try and develop new treatments or improve our treatment options so that we can improve outcome for all of these babies. One thing that I've been looking at is a, a peptide, which is a small protein. It's a drug that we can use to block a particular type of channel um, and we believe that this channel is involved in the spread of injury. So after something like oxygen deprivation, these channels can open and allow for release of toxic signals, which can um, spread cell death through the brain. And I've shown that by blocking these channels, we can actually reduce the development of brain damage. So we're currently testing whether this could be used along with cooling to improve um, the chances of these babies having a healthy healthy life and avoiding brain damage. It's something that really is a big problem for us uh, in hospitals in trying to improve how we can treat these babies. So it's something that can really make a difference to people's lives, both to the babies themselves and to the parents who are caring for them.